you can hear me. Fuck, it's raining so fucking loud and I'm driving on like the world's worst fucking made highway ever and you're literally propped up on my rubber duck that I have on my console. Today I am driving back to campus. Yeah. Nashville is supposed to get like eight inches. Oh shit. Okay, Nashville is supposed to get like eight inches of fucking snow tonight. And so I stayed up until 5 a.m. last night, or I guess this morning. And I did not pack at all. So my mom comes into my room this morning at like 8 a.m. And, <laughs> and she was like, Lily. And I was like, I don't know. And then she was like, you need to get up and you need to pack and you need to be out of this house by 10. Keep in mind, I hadn't packed anything and I also had to like, I brought my apartment fish home. So I had to put my fish into his little like travel container and then like pack the tank up and shit. My fish's name is also Tank. So I had to get Tank and then pack Tank's tank. Yeah, like I don't even remember anything from this morning. I literally just like going through the motions. I think I, I made coffee at some point. I'm on my second cup right now. And I, you know, this is like pathetic because 10 a.m. is not even early. Oh my gosh. 10 a.m. is not even early. So like, this is like such a bad thing to complain about. So I had to get out of the house at 10. It's currently like noon. So I have, I love the way the, the camera is just, so I have two hours left of this drive and then I'll be home but literally I'm gonna get to Nashville and then I'm just gonna be stuck in my dorm all weekend I could if this doesn't fucking stop I'm literally gonna be stuck in my dorm <laughs> until like our classes start on Tuesday because we're supposed to get eight inches of snow like what am I gonna do and so my mom packed me like three coolers full of like random ass food Cause she was like, you do not need to leave your apartment, Lily. I was like, I'm sorry, this road is pissing me off. I haven't eaten this morning, I'm hangry. Okay, and now I'm more hangry than I was to fucking begin with because I just had to delete Minecraft because I was out of storage. I had just built like a really cool world and I had given my horse diamond armor that I founded a village. Anyways. So when I'm hungry, I become like, I don't even know, like not, not a normal human. I don't even like myself. I think I would actually like, if I met myself as like a separate person when I was hungry, I think, oh, they had a Pikachu thing. I think that I would literally like maybe try to murder myself. Um, my plan right now is to get in a Nashville and then get Chick-fil-A and I swear if it starts snowing I'm gonna be very upset because like obviously send the workers home. They shouldn't have to be there But I also I can, I've been really craving Chick-fil-A So hopefully that works out, but we will see. If not, I'm gonna be eating like canned chicken noodle soup. Bro! Sorry. Well, I've been listening to podcast because I was too tired to like play music this morning. I've been listening to like Rotten Mango, which is my favorite fucking podcast to ever exist. I love Stephanie Sue. God, I would probably die for Stephanie Sue. It's like people I would die for. Taylor Swift, Stephanie Sue, family. I just ran over like a fucking car part. Like, how are car parts even on the road? Do like people's cars just fall apart when they're, it's, my car would do that probably with the way I drive. I'm trying to drive really good right now for Tank because I don't want him to like, he's so old. I don't want him to fucking croak on the drive. That seems a bit traumatic. I love how the angle switches every single time I start talking. That's so cool and fun. I hope you can fucking hear me. It's loud as fuck. This might be like an exclusively southern, no, it most definitely probably is an exclusively southern thing. But every time I drive to Nashville and even like on the way back, there are so many billboards that are anti-abortion. Like most of them are a baby and the baby's like, just like that, literally just like that. And then it's like, Jesus loves all of us. As a Christian, that's the stupidest fucking billboard I've ever heard of. Like, shut up. I know a man wrote that billboard. And you know what? Maybe he should have. I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> I think that driving through 
like, I don't even know. Like, I see shit. When I'm in Memphis, it's like, Graceland. Oh, Graceland. And then, when I get closer, it's like, Dolly Park. Which, I fuck with Dolly Park. And she's a cool bitch. Nice boobs. Not that I'm like, look. Not that I'm lucky, but like, to get them. And then, like, there's just like, random ass small towns where like, all they have is a gas station and then like, a Zaxby's. Like, what is the population here? What is the goal? And then, like, obviously, you've got like the lifted trucks that are so fucking ugly, by the way. If you have one, return it, get a refund. Um, like the lifted trucks with like the LEDs under, and then it's like front, front bright on the back with like a fucking American flag sticking out of like your truck. Like, dude. Just say you get no bitches and move on, okay? So sorry i am literally the worst but i was so <laughs> stressed out because when i pulled into belmont there were cars everywhere there were like crossing guards and shit and so i could not vlog anymore because i'm already a bad driver so i was like not trying to get into a wreck obviously i made it i'm in my room in my apartment now i'm so happy um it's the next day so i've been here for like a hot minute and I've started to unpack and everything and I'm so excited to be back. It's so nice. It actually snowed. I'll try to like insert some clips or maybe do like a snow day vlog or something. It's literally so beautiful. It's so perfect to be back and then it's just so pretty and comforting. Yeah, it's amazing. Um, so now I'm just sitting in my room and doing some homework and looking at the snow. I couldn't be more happy that you guys came along for the road trip with me. It makes me feel less lonely even though literally it's like a few days later when you guys are gonna see it. But yeah, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I always feel like these are so boring so fingers crossed this wasn't that bad and you can actually hear me over the sound of the wind when I'm driving. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. I appreciate you all so much and I'll see you soon. Bye!